today we are going to talk about this one OL. Let's let's read the universe number one. Prison, prison, prison is a place. Uh, criminals uh, go to the prison because they do something wrong. Number two, feed. Feed means to give food to someone. To give food to someone. Every day, my mother feeds my son. Number two, number three, text. Text means to send messages to your friends. Text means to send messages to your friend. Every day, I text my friends and my. Uh, number five, uh, typical. Typical means usual. Typical means usual. On my typical weekend, I go to my grandfather. After that, chair. Chair means to give something to someone. Means every day I share my food with my son. Uh, let's see some expressions and expressions. Number one, leave home. Leave home. I leave home every day in the morning. Number two, good for uh, milk is good for me. After that, uh, take away. Uh, every day I take the rubbish away. After that, on my way home. Every day on my way home, I buy some groceries. The last one, the water plants. Water plants here as a verb. The farmer waters his plants every day in the field. After that, let's see some words. Number one, right at. The difference between a right at and a right in. A right at to go or uh, to arrive in a small place. To arrive at a small place. I arrive at my school at 5 o'clock. Arrive at, but arrive in means to arrive in big places like countries and cities. Uh, it equals uh, get to, get to means to arrive in or at. I get to my school and I get to London is the same meaning. Reach uh, is the same, but reach, we don't use any preposition with reach. After that, let's see our grammar number one, uh, present simple. Present simple, we use a present simple to talk about facts, habits, and daily routines. Again, we use a present simple to talk about facts, habits, and routines. We, we talked before about this uh, tense, uh, but let's see number one, Ali lives in Giza. This sentence refers to a fact. Number two, uh, she watches TV at night, it refers to a habit. After this, they usually sleep early and this is a daily routine sentence. But uh, pay attention, Ali lives, we put S to the verb. Uh, she watches, we put E S. So uh, with, the, uh, with the pronouns he, she, at, as we said before, we put S, E, S, or I, D, S. But in the plural pronouns or the plural noun, we put the verb in the infinitive. Uh, let's see if we want to make a negative form. Uh, number one, we don't listen to music, so we use don't with plural pronouns. Omar doesn't give up at 7 o'clock, doesn't plus infinitive, again doesn't plus infinitive, but pay attention, Omar doesn't give up at 7 o'clock, and Omar never gets, gets up. So with doesn't, we put the verb infinitive, but with the advent of frequency, we keep the S as it, as it is. So, if you want to make yes or no question, we use do and does with subject and infinitive verb. Like this sentence, do you watch TV after 9? Number 2, does he text his friends at 9? So, we use do and does if you want to make yes or no question. If you want to make double H question, we use double H plus do or does plus subject plus verb infinitive. Like the sentence number one, what do they read every day and where does Ali or his car? Double word, do or does, subject, plus verb. Uh, let's go to talk about the adverbs of frequency. As we said before, usually, always, often, sometimes, never. Number one, Ali usually plays, so the adverbs of frequency comes before the main verb usually plays, but number two, we never go to school on Fridays, so adverbs of frequency comes before the main verb and after the verb to be. Again, before the main verb and after the verb to be. Number three, she's never late for school. She's never before the verb to be. Let's uh, 
uh, let's back to number one. I like to space my friends in the evening. So the right answer is the guest. I like to the guest. We said that the guest means to send messages to your friends. Number three, come and sit on this space. Uh, four people can sit on it. Come and sit on this sofa. Yes. Number three, do you space lunch at home? Yes. Do you have lunch at home? The last one, people space swim in the sea when it's too cold. When it's too cold, so the right answer is never. That's all. Thank you and good luck.